we almost done, sweetheart? My legs are getting a little numb. Just shift your weight, honey. I gave you a break an hour ago. Okay, but it looks like Bobby's getting ready to faint again. <laughs> Fresh air! Amy and Bobby, you get back here. I'm not done yet. Oh, Larry, Larry, you're not gonna believe what I've been through today. Chris, huh? you do not live in this house. Uh -huh. If you want to come over, call first. This will give us ample time to get in the car and drive away. That's very nice, Sharon. Just stamp on my heart in my time of need. Larry, I just came from my first modeling gig. It was a total disaster. Who would have guessed? Larry, it was awful. They treated me like I was Marilyn Chambers. They made me take off my top. Well, thank you for putting that image in my mind. Don't you understand? Those photos could wind up anywhere. Oh, modeling just sucks. I'm completely revolted and disenchanted. Pretty much the way you probably felt on your honeymoon. Chris, Chris, it's real simple what happened here. You wanted to be a male model, but you can't be. And as usual, you are the last one on the planet to figure that out. You know, Sharon, for once in your life, you might be right. I guess I just couldn't see beyond the brim of my handsome boy trainee cap. I'm a failure as a model. That's not exactly true. You're a failure at many things. All I'll ever get are cheap, sleazy ads, while guys with half my looks will be prancing up and down the runway at Drexler's department store, making everyone in the audience feel like dirt. Damn, why can't that be me? Wait a second. It can be me. It can. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go down to Drexler's, and I'm gonna live my dream. One way or another, I'm gonna be in a runway show.